let's kind of give you an idea of what happened after a horrendous drive at 13 where he took an unplayable and 20 minutes later he finally lined this third up to the long par 4 13. Yeah, and he didn't like this shot. He hit it fat and there was a lot of trouble up there and it just got through the trouble and and then this was no gimme to get this up and down. Johnny. This is, might be where he won the championship right here. This is not an easy little pitch and up and over that little brow and the hump and then down there for about an eight footer. While he was doing this, Kuchar parted, it, but it could have been a two-shot lead for Kuchar. Instead, just one because Spieth buried the five. Because that felt like a triple bogey. He <laughs> ended up with just bogey. It felt like a lifetime. It took about a half hour to complete the hole. He lost the lead for the first time all weekend. And then what does he do? He gets up to the 14th with a six iron on a 201-yard hole and walks that just about in. One inch from going in. So it's another birdie for Spieth. He ties Kuchar at eight under, and then this from 48 feet. And this is that 35-inch uh, dagger he carries in his bag. <laughs> so he eagled Kuchar birdied it to stay within one as he regained the outright lead, and then he gets to 16 for another birdie. I mean, this is a putt that's not that easy to make. It's sort of a vague putt somehow. There it goes again. So at that point, after the bogey at 13, he's four under in a span of three holes. And then he gets to the par 5, 17th. This was his third. If you were with us, you know, the description here, he had to just get it just on that ridge and just skip it up there. And that is exactly what he did. Put the brakes on it. I mean, Kuchar put the pressure on Yeah, Kuchar made a nice long birdie outside of Spieth, and then Spieth just kind of rolls it in to match the birdie, keep his two-shot lead. And then while Kuchar got into trouble at 18, it was just a formality. Spieth took an iron off the tee. A good second shot. Took that walk up through those two twin giant iconic scoreboards. And his name on top. An embrace with Michael Greta as they have won their second straight start. And so Spieth, you know, you talk about all the greats that he's joined. He does stand alone in this department. He's the youngest player James ever with three major victories and 11 PGA Tour wins. No one in the history of golf has pulled that off.